It's not over just yet for former President Jacob Zuma. The Constitutional Court has agreed to hear his application to have its ruling against him rescinded. Zuma had until tomorrow to hand himself over to begin his prison term, but that's changing now. Let's unpack why that is, what's going on, what's changed. ENCA's Barry Bateman is here for us. Barry, dramatic turn of events this afternoon. The Constitutional Court agrees to hear Zuma's application. That's strange. Some legal people are saying it's unprecedented. What exactly influenced that? Yeah, things happening very quickly, Omar, on this particular matter, which was in the last hour that the Constitutional Court has issued directions in relation to uh, President, former President Jacob Zuma's application, uh, rescission application, saying that they will hear the application on the 12th of July. That's not this Monday, that's the following Monday. They've set very strict timelines. On Tuesday, they want to have any opposing affidavits uh, by any particular party that would oppose the application filed. It wants uh, replying affidavits in by Wednesday and all other formalities related to the back and the to and froing of the paperwork related to this matter sorted out by Friday. The application will be heard uh, virtually uh, on the Monday. Um, and um, the, the net effect of this, as we understand it, I've spoken a short while ago to uh, Attorney Ulrich Ruhn, he explained to me, uh, you just touched on it, that there was this requirement in terms of the Constitutional Court order handed down on Tuesday that Zuma present himself to the, uh, the police by tomorrow, failing which the police would have three days to secure uh, his arrest. Now that is essentially stayed until this application is heard. And the way it would be best explained is if you think of in a high court, for example, where you would apply for application for leave to appeal and you are granted it, uh, the net effect of that is that the order that is being appealed is put on suspension. Although this is not an appeal, it's a rescission application, it has that effect as we understand it. So the requirement that he present himself to the police tomorrow and the order that the police act if he fails to present himself, that is put on the back burner until this matter is dispensed with, with that hearing taking place in a week from Monday. Zuma's now been seen for the first time in public since the Constitu Constitutional Court sentenced him. He was seen earlier this afternoon flanked by Amabuto at his Nkandla homestead. His supporters have been arriving in numbers from different parts of the country, pledging loyalty and support. Suspended ANC Secretary General Ace Mahashula also arrived.